All right, so you apply to Google AdSense and you can't get approved. I'm gonna tell you why. Free your body and your mind. All right, guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, codingface.com. Your boy is backing out and did it again. Now on Lottie. All right, so you can't get approved to Google AdSense. Why? So what exactly is Google AdSense? Google AdSense is literally Google's ad network where basically they let advertisers advertising other people's websites. So basically there's advertisers and there's publishers. So you are the content creator, you are the developer, you are the person who's on YouTube or wherever you at, right? And you're like, hey man, I wanna get some advertising on my videos, I wanna get some advertising on my website. I wanna get paid, right? So because you wanna get paid, what you do is you apply to Google AdSense. But then now they send you a long email and tell you, hey man, sorry buddy, we can't accept you, right? And the reason why they can't accept you, number one, insufficient content. A lot of times people have a website that they just created and they just got the domain and they say, hey man, my website, uh, teletubbies.com, <laughs> I just created it, let's get some advertising. But what you don't know is that Google looks at that and says, hey man, we already know people are trying to scheme it. People are creating websites every single day and then we approve people and then they don't even put the right type of content in there. Number two, it could be that you don't have private policy page. You don't have a disclaimer. You don't have an about page. You don't have a contact page. You don't have information about you. Why are they going to approve you if you don't have anything that shows like, hey, you're the owner of this website, okay? You have to understand that. Google now has rules because everybody applies to Google AdSense, but not everybody on Google AdSense wanna follow the policies. Not everybody that applies to Google AdSense even have their contact information on their website, which is already iffy. You get what I'm saying? So make sure you have those informations in there. Number three, page design. So if your page is super cluttered and your page has, you know, an image right here, a paragraph right here, image, 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 video, ads popping up, crazy stuff going on. Ah! Okay. <laughs> if you have all of that on your website, of course not. You're not gonna get approved. You have to understand Google wants to be partner with websites that are actually legit you know have you ever been to those websites that look like it was made in geo cities in 1999 or angel fire and the design of it looks crazy the typography is is crazy everything is made with serif fonts and display fonts and it looks crazy it's hard to read google is not gonna approve you with that so you have to make sure your website looks good it's up to you to have that. Number four, your website breaks the policies, okay? If you have things like how to cheat online, how to hack a website, uh, how to get stuff for free, torrents, how to get movies in for free, how to download this for free, those type of things, Google looks down upon that. It's like, nah, we don't wanna deal with this. We don't wanna get sued. So these are the reasons why you can't get approved for Google AdSense. If you want to know all the proper ways and all the proper steps to make sure that you get approved as a developer or as a content creator or as a owner of a business, right? Make sure you go check out Lottie. All right. It's going to be in the description below. So if you like this type of content, guys, go subscribe to my new channel. It's called Lottie. It literally means living off the internet. You are a developer. I want to teach you guys how to make money online. I want to teach you guys all of the steps, how to make sure that you are successful as a developer. Okay? Not only can you make money from your job, you can make side income. I mean, you guys tell me. You guys tell me if you want to know how to make $5,000 on top of whatever salary you're making at your job, now you can make that on the side. Let me know, leave a comment below, 
Tell me, hey Joe, we care about this. We want to make side income. We want to use the skills that we have. If you do, leave a comment. If you don't, I don't know. Just don't leave anything, all right? It's your boy Joe back at it again, codingface.com. Your boy's back, and I done did it again. This video is brought to you by CodingFace.com and all of its members. Make sure you go visit the website. It's the only place where you're gonna learn how to become a web developer with real projects. Take it from me, it's your boy Joe, back at it again, CodingFace.com. Keep it real, keep it trill.